Amen, amen church. church. Amen, amen church. church. Can I hear you say amen? amen. Church, church, hallelujah. Now listen. No, listen, listen, listen. This, this morning, morning I'm very I'm angry. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not comfortable. comfortable. I'm not comfortable because of what is going on in Zamfara State. Some people are trying to be so foolish in this country, Nigeria. The rumor has it that, um, that they are killing people because of they, they discover gold or what I don't understand how the rumor is going, but that's not my issue. My issue is this why is it that a normal human being born of a woman can just wake up one morning? And we want to kill somebody else because of position of something you want to take over. Number one, Mr. President, President Muhammad Bugaria, I want to say this to you. I think it is high time you, you, you wake up to this and deal this once and for all. Overlook who is involved. Whether politicians, whether Christians or Muslims, I, I, we, we need you to, to rise in this particular time. You know, what, what I'm saying and what I'm hearing concerning Zamfara is so disgracing. I, I don't have much things to say. I will only read one scripture. Whether you're Muslim or Christian, here. Take me to Genesis 2 verse 7. Genesis chapter 2 verse 7. Let everybody hear it so that you will understand who you are. <laughs> Genesis chapter 2 verse 7 yes sir. yes sir and the Lord God formed man and God created you that is killing other people of the dust of the ground by the dust with the dust of the ground and bread into his nursery and now bread is from bread into your nursery bread into you the bread of life the bread of life and man became a living soul now you became a living soul now you hear me you are an immigrant on earth no matter whatever you want to acquire and you start killing people one day you will die and become go back to the dust man hear me whether you're a muslim or a christian you are what a man dust the wrath of god is about to fall upon those who always find it joy to destroy people because of things here on earth if you don't have it if you don't know it i'm telling you now you are an immigrant here one day you will go back to where you came from a what is enough for the what for the wives if you continue the god of heaven who breathed into you to be in existence who formed in your mother's womb might take what he has given to you at that time i shall then know where you will stand to kill people. Why are you killing people? Even if it's not all about the miming or the gold, no matter whatever it is, what is it here on earth that shall cause you to kill your full man or woman? Mr. President, I'm using this opportunity to call on you and say, rise up to this situation. Give your directives as chief commander and let this killing end. And I pray for God's grace upon you as you lead us to the expected good end of this country. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. And the church will say amen.